Now, the other thing I didn't show you on here on table design, something that's so, so nice is the total row. So again, if you clicked off your table, no table design tools. So make sure you're clicked on the table, table design and click to check a header row. Pardon me, not a header row. I meant the total row, a red header row. <laughs> This is nice too, because when you turn on the total row, you can come down here and you can click and it gives us, I'll scroll so you can see it right there in the middle. It gives us a little drop down of our favorite math functions. So if I wanna get a count of how many rows um, I've got, if I want to get an average quantity, an average price, and then a sum of total sales. Now watch me rock this, where now I say, hey, I really just want to see, um, I drop open product name, and I say desktop, <clears throat> okay. I'm getting a count of desktops, all the regions. Let's say I just want to see desktops in the Northeast. Suddenly I'm filtered down to just that nugget of information. And I'll see people sometimes, you can tell it's filtered. You've got bright blue out here. You can see that you've got filter buttons uh, up here. So bright blue, little filter funnels. And down at the bottom, it, it will even tell you four out of 80 or 81 rows. You could take this now, copy and paste it to another sheet, give someone a report. That would work. <laughs>